Hey, what is up? I am Mog Dragon. And here I am again. <laughs> here I am back at the Warden Cellar. Trying to fight Krieg because I decided to remake and re <laughs> redo it again. Because I, I, I said earlier, I said yesterday that I liked this low play style of the battle mage that I played. But it felt, it felt, it felt so much lower than I thought it would. The longer I got, I got into Blood Grove and it, it felt unnecessarily slow. And I started to feel like the gearing options might be a problem if I play Kalidor's Tempest CT. And also the devotions kind of feel off, aside from the defensive devotions. I, it felt like I was going to have a hard time dealing damage. Yeah, setting up my devotions to deal damage. So I decided to play a basic force wave build and for now I've only gotten soldier because I don't really know what I want to go next. I'm probably just thinking of Demolitionist because because it's basic. <laughs> Demolitionist just grants you so many things. But I also don't want to play Demolitionist because I don't want to play Commando. Commando feels so basic. <laughs> it's nothing new. I've played s I just don't want to play anything with Demolitionist anymore because I play Demolitionist all the time because it just it's 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 the much easier mastery. It's probably the easiest mastery to level with and to play with, especially if you're new. So yeah, I was thinking Warder, but I really don't know. I, I, I'm also thinking of I, what I really want is to play Force Wave because I've always also wanted to play Force Wave. I just don't like playing physical builds because I just don't play physical builds in almost any game. It's either I play healer, support, if there's, if there's not a thing in a game. I would probably play Summoner if if there's no such thing as both. I'd probably play a Mage. And if that game does not have a Mage or anything, a Summoner, a Healer, a Support, I'm probably not gonna play that game. No. So yeah, that's why I don't play physical builds. So I was thinking if I can make Force Wave into an elemental build which I really don't know that it's possible but I'm thinking of playing it no I'm not thinking probably not but that's probably what what I'm gonna do if I'm gonna play warder but I'm also thinking if I can make a force wave build based on bleed yeah I don't know I'm just trying to make things complicated I'm just making things complicated for me. <laughs> yeah, it's been so much faster now compared to the battle mage I just did. <laughs> it's so freaking slow. Too slow. It's a bit too slow. Let's do this. Let's do it. Oh no, it's much so much faster so much faster but so much scarier ouch oh, so much scarier indeed also I'm confused why force wave does not have additional mana cost for the upgrades of the skill it's kind of weird because most of the skills have an additional mana cost, energy cost, when you use it, when you upgrade it, and Force Wave just has the same static energy cost despite the upgrades. 
in the skill. It's weird. So I was thinking that maybe because the force wave is you can play it at ranged, I can get away with not having a shield. Because I really I was looking forward to play a shield shield build for hardcore. But it doesn't seem like I was also thinking of using a shield build with force wave. I don't know how that would work. Because I and also if you're going to play a shield shield build, I'm going to have to need an attack replacer which would mean additional cost and skill points well if I had just had this I would only need this and this and then I could just roll the whole game probably uh, warrior or uh, yeah whatever that's it. Bye.